Hi, Scorpio. This is your... Oh, I, I hear that's dangerous. That's dangerous. That's dangerous. I hear... I'm hearing that. Um, this is your channel messages for the 21st of June. Let's go, Sagittarius. You... Sagittarius, why must they... No. Oh, I'm so sorry. Scorpio... Oh, Scorpio. Hi, Scorpio. I didn't mean to say Sagittarius, I mean to say Scorpio. Hi, this is your channel messages for the 21st of June. I was hearing that's dangerous. Now, you are a walking in body, Scorpio, so you may take on a lot of dangerous activities because you will have no fear for death. That's one thing that I learned about life, you know. You see, if you're scared of death, you'll go nowhere. You'll be locked up in a... You fearing death is you fearing opinions. You know that? Because you fear that the image of you may change in the eyes of people. Let's go ahead and go into your reading. Scorpio, I was also getting um, clear audience, your clear audience. I'm getting someone's really underestimating how far you can pick up sound waves. I'm guessing somebody could be in another country and pick up sound waves, right? No, the average person will say, Scorpio, you're fucking schizophrenic. You need medication, right? But we're getting Scorpio. Them have no idea how much the dead favor you. I'm also getting Scorpio if you are Scorpio, especially if you have Scorpio and a Pluto, Scorpio and a Lilith, Scorpio and a Venus. There are rituals that people are going to use on you. Drugs sharing passing the, the blunt right cigarettes cooking them love cook scorpio scorpio remember your body can't handle spirit cooking so cooking is a ritual for you it is witches brew for you that's why you can't cook so fucking good because you cook with your spirit I would also say, Scorpio, be very, be very wary if somebody want to sit down and watch them cook. Them a cook you. And be very wary when you're cooking or who is in the room when you're cooking for them. Because you're cooking the spirits together, Scorpio, okay? So something about spirit cooking. I hear that not a lot of people can withstand that, okay? You're getting it, you can, your mind can withstand this. It will knock you the fuck out though. If you don't know what you do, or you feel like your, 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 your blood potent and you're going in one room and then a spirit cookie, you will, you will drop down, you hear? So you have to be careful. We have fuck them all coming out first. So fuck them all, Scorpio. Scorpio, I feel like somebody's trying to. Scorpio, I feel like. A part of brainwashing you is to make it feel like you're dead. There's no business, there's no traffic, there's no patronage. You feel like a dead body. And then when them have you in the state of death, or when them have you in the state of, you know what, not not going for me, I feel like a dead body, then somebody will come and make the dead body walk. After a very, very long pause, Somebody will come to you and they're going to offer you an opportunity. And I'm getting you're supposed to take the opportunity because everything around you dead and nothing now go on. But somebody's trying to brainwash you for act like a walking, living body when you are the dead. That's like somebody's trying to brainwash a prophet for basically go lay bricks. I'm getting you need to remember where you come from. Because part of your brainwash, part part of the brainwashing technique they're using on you is for, for you to forget who you are, so you can take on the persona of somebody else. Okay, Scorpio, fuck them all. When I care for your mother, when I care for your blood clot, father, fuck them all. If it's your kids, it's different, especially if they're still under twelve. It's different. Otherwise, fuck them all. We got temperance, the angel, yeah. And remember, dead bodies are not only demonic. Sometimes angel possess it too. You remember, I will walk with you where sun don't even shine. Walk with you 
Every night I'm gonna be walk with you. Touched by an angel. Yeah. You think the angel can't tell her for fuck off? Hmm? The angel up can not say fuck off. Especially to the fucking demon them. We have the Hierophant. I am telling you this. You might have Scorpio in a very dominating placement. Me getting somebody a trifle make you forget who, what you are or what your purpose is. I don't care if it not bring in money. You think the people them who stand up and preach the word of the Lord and make money? Mm? You think the people them who, when me did that Jamaica, when you see the whole heap of religious people come from JUTC, but stand up and preach the word of the Lord. After they did preach the word of the Lord, they would have asked for a donation. Some people would have skin up their face and say, you know what, you, you're making too much noise in the morning while I'm going to work. I don't want to give you shit, right? And others would get, drop a little thing in them bucket, right? The Harafant and Temperance. The Temperance don't do them job just because they want uh, income. They do them job because it's their calling. They do them job for secure them place in the afterlife. Not for secure them place at the Blue, Jay, the Blue, Blue Jays games. So that's not why they're doing their job. So you should know this. Let's go ahead again. We have Forbidden Fruits. And we have cheating. Yeah. I'm getting someone who wants cheat to alter your destiny. Or forbidden fruit. It's the last of your kind. And everybody want you use you. Everybody want you in a picture with them. Everybody want you to be their friend. Everybody wants you to just listen to what they say. Scorpio, you yeah, are the dead body. You need to remember, when you are alone, then you can resurrect everything that comes within your energy. But when you're with people, it is imperative for you to learn from them. You don't need to be in a, in a circle trying to prove that you're the most knowledgeable based on the past lives that you have lived. You need to listen to people who are talk on this incarnation now. Because not all of them are going to reincarnate. Some of them, this are them only and final um, place where they are going to um, gain enlightenment. You are going to come back. You will always come back, Scorpio. And every time you come back, you come back as the same thing. As somebody who are going to lead the people. Who free the people over hills and valleys too. Don't let them fool you. Don't believe one minute that they are with you. Ja free the people over hills and valleys too. Let's go, Scorpio. They say that the dead is only used by Satan. But the last time I checked, Jesus' story was completed when he died and was resurrected. He was died and resurrected. And then he lived on to tell his story. Actually, he actually um, ascended to the sky. Like a fucking alien. That's what the fuck he did. We got the six of cups coming first. We're getting the burial place. I'm getting something about a, a, a cemetery. There's something about a cemetery. I see you're, lay, you're laying flowers on someone's cemetery. Or what I see that's being done in um, Caribbean countries, them not put tombstones anymore. Them are put cutouts of the people them. So when you go to the cemetery, you can see the cutout pictures of them, life-size pictures, big, big life-size pictures, cardboard cutouts. Because nobody want them name on a tomb anymore. That doesn't tell you what the person was or was not in them life. They want a picture. I'm not talking about the old picture like when them shrivel up in the newspaper. The same newspaper where people are crushed up and use a wipe window with Windex, right? We are talking about a huge ass cutout at the burial ground. We have the moon card. I'm seeing you going to the cemetery at night. We have the nine of cups. And we have the, we have the strength card. Me getting you yeah, go to a cemetery. Me getting something when it comes down to a cemetery and a marriage. I don't know if you have the graveyard magic so you can be engaged to somebody or you want somebody to fall in love with you. So yeah, use graveyard magic for this. I'm getting some close relation. I don't know if your fiancé passed away or your wife dead. I'm getting you engaged. 
to a Leo. But the Leo don't know, say, you work with a funeral home, some weird shit like that. I also smell it. I don't know what it smell like. But I just get a sense now. My nose like I'm getting embalmment fluid. Um, I don't know if you know where your man work or you know where your woman work. I'm getting she pies on your ear here. And she engaged to you and she make you believe that you're sick. I'm getting as you engage to this man, your mental health start decline. All of a sudden, you need mental um evaluation all of a sudden you feel like you can't take care of yourself no more you need this man to help you forget your own and me getting the man is very attentive to you the man is helping you around the house helping you take a bath and him a cook dinner for you me getting the man is also the reason why you're sick so this look very evil okay me getting you don't know why a man no maybe a man is a obia man maybe a man is a voodoo specialist maybe he's a i'm not getting a cultist because a cultist do things differently that's when you know when a man is of um obia and voodoo and when he is of their cult it's a them use different techniques for the things And real occultists will never take away your spiritual gifts. They won't do that. Vo people with the voodoo and obia and, and, and witchcraft, them will do them things if they take away your spiritual gifts. Occultists will, won't do that. We have the Nine of Cups. We have the Wheel of Fortune. We have the Moon card. We have the Moon card two times. I'm getting something okay so we have the moon card and the wheel of fortune and then we have the moon card and the nine of cups there's something about a jewish wedding or something about twin tw twin females female twins may i get something about a jewish wedding and a jewish morgue we're getting something about a leo woman Are me getting you sit down on somebody's grave and you yeah, drink? Me none, are any, you see any type of voodoo you do or any type of witchcraft this Jewish man or this Jewish woman I do, she use alcohol for do it. Now, being very experienced, working, you see, that's why sometimes some occultists will talk about Jewish people. And some people will talk about Jews. Nobody can tell me blood clot about Jews and Jewish people. I don't give a fuck. We used to work with them real jewish people we used to blood clot work with them so you can't no book you will read can blood clot tell me about jewish people now i know during shabbat sundown on a friday after they set them table and have their ceremony they will drink a lot but taste blood Do Jewish, do high level Jewish men crave blood when them intoxicated? Come here, taste blood now. And you know, animal blood don't taste the same as human blood, right? We're getting something about one, 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 something that was performed. Like a ritual when it comes down to a, a old dead there's something about an old woman old jewish woman she old and she got dead soon i'm um, getting on the one i'm getting something about it's either like a burial or another cremator you better bury and you better cremate that bitch and bury her you hear that's all, I, that's all i'm gonna say to you okay great and we have the empress yeah me getting some me getting something about your consciousness me literally getting that you married your grandmother this 
some this is this is feeling creepy to me and it's too fucking early yeah the strength card and the empress me keep a taste blood from my tongue me getting something out of leo she could be taurus or libra as well Me getting this woman was supposed to marry one Jewish man, or she was supposed to have a big, big, big ass Jewish wedding. And me getting them switch her out with another woman. Or something about on your wedding day, you were highly intoxicated. Me getting there was a ritual performed on you the night when you were intoxicated, or when you were sleeping. I'm also getting something about you being the empress, but it's like this is what you are on the forefront, but they must say your confidence needs to be up more. You, you need to be more confident. You need to be more cocky. You need to be more boastful. Princess Diana wasn't that type of woman. Princess Diana wasn't a cocky woman. She wasn't a boastful woman. I'm getting something happen for your wedding night. The night when the night when you got married, something happened. Or something about a lot of Jewish men getting intoxicated. There's something weird here. Not weird, but I, the Harafant, Temperance. Unless you're gonna marry one Jewish man, me getting him fucked on you before he marry you, basically. If that's what you want to know, he did fuck on you, he did. On his bachelor night, he did fuck another girl. And maybe that's something you're okay with, knowing that, okay, it's the last time I'm gonna fuck a man. Oh, somebody may be gay. So you might have to marry one man for wealth, or you're gonna marry him for status, but me getting the man really like men. You're only marrying him for status. Are you marrying for money? Are you marrying for, for, for getting to something? But me getting the man don't like women. He's actually gay. Yeah, for being fruit. Unless me getting a gay man I'm gonna marry you. Me getting you in a two. You, you, you might be in a relationship. You're in a two. You, you, me getting you be in a one relationship with two men. It's the man where you marry him gay. Him not like pussy. But you're gonna marry him for a certain reason. And me getting you're going to be having sex with another man. It could be a cancer. Or me getting something about a Jewish man in my gear the whole I'm riches. And tell you for do what you want with it. I feel like you have no fucking idea how much wealth you're about to get. But me getting something have to be sealed with alcohol. Or the spirit. The spirit have to possess you first. I feel like somebody want to know if, if, if them can actually put the spirit in you. Watch the spirit. And um, host you. And then watch the spirit leave your body. Somebody want to actually see this in up close and personal. I'm going to get two more. And then let's just done this reading. Yeah, no phones allowed. No technology. Leo. Yes, yeah, something about a Leo woman. Maybe somebody was trying to switch you with a Leah woman. But me getting Leah is the son. That's the boastful one. That is the prideful one. You are Venus. You you're 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 of Princess Diana energy. Somebody's name could be Diana or Diane. I'ma leave it here. Until next time, Scorpio.